In this video, we'll be going over the quick steps involved in getting started with Edge to Cloud. The first step is to register an account on the Edge to Cloud server. If you do not have an account, you can start by contacting your authorized distribution partner or your designated J2 sales or support representative so that they can get you started on creating an account. Once your user account is created, you will receive an email that enables you to complete the user registration process. The email will include a link and instructions on how to begin registering your account. After you have logged in and have provided a new password, you will need to register and agree to the terms and conditions. Once you have completed the user registration process, you will have access to the portal. From the portal, you can access your entire portfolio of devices, sites, projects, and users. Click on the user icon in the top right hand corner. This gives you a list of all of the organizations of which you are a member. Click on your organization to navigate to its main page. This view shows all of the details for your organization. If your user has access to administrative roles, you can also add, edit, and invite new users into your organization through this view. Click Home to go to the map page for Edge to Cloud. Since we have no devices registered, the next step is to access the desired FIN instance and register it with FIN Edge to Cloud in order to securely access it from anywhere in the world. To begin the registration process, log into the FIN server you'd like to add to the cloud. Open FIN and click on the cloud application. If you have not yet registered this server, you will see unregistered badges next to the cloud registration tabs indicating that FIN is currently disconnected and not registered with Edge to Cloud. Start by clicking on the register with Edge to Cloud option. If you have the device manager role in your organization, you will see the above screen where you can register the device. Select your organization from the drop down list and click register. Your FIN instance should now be registered with FIN Edge to Cloud. To verify, go back to FIN and click the cloud application icon again. The status should now say connected. Assuming FIN has internet access, FIN will now automatically connect to Edge to Cloud and synchronize its device project and site information. Navigate back to the portal's homepage. Note the number of devices and sites registered is now reading as one. If you'd like for your sites to appear in the world map, go back into your project database and make sure that the longitude and latitude properties have been set on the desired sites. Once that is complete, a marker will appear on the map representing that specific site. Your newly added FIN instance can now be viewed in the Devices tab. The Project tab down below displays a list of all available projects, and the Sites tab down below that provides a list of all of the available sites. Now that your FIN instance is registered, it should now be accessible and available to anyone in your organization who has the relevant permissions, allowing for you and your team to now securely access FIN remotely from anywhere in the world. We hope you've enjoyed this video and want to wish you another fantastic day. Thanks for watching.